Well, good evening, everyone. I got a birthday present from my sister that arrived. And I'm really, really eager to open this up and see what we got. Uh, Amazon boxes. Uh, this one's already coming apart down here at the bottom. Here. So, it might be the easiest way to get it open here. I've never tried opening a package with one hand, but we'll see if we can get this one open. Amazon tape isn't the best. So, okay. Now, uh, I've got one little thing. Ah, it's some drops for inflammation, relief support. Oh, I really want to try these. See if it helps some of the joint inflammation I have with my RA. So, put that to one side. And this, well, let's see what this says. It says, Cable double hammock, two person, for travel patio garden. And the rest of what's in here is, oh, yep, it's from my sister. My note says, it's good to have options. Enjoy your gift. That's awesome. So, I'm going to see, put that back in here, and then we'll check out this box. Okay. I probably should have brought something to open this box with. Uh, let's go see if I can find something to open the box with. Okay, we're back, and let's pair of kitchen shears, and let's see what we got here. And I think this is the rest of the hammock. Let's see. Get this box to open. Oh, the instructions are down here. And they look a little beat up. But, okay. Assembly instructions. These are always good to have. Okay. I'll have to set this thing up and let's get back and see what it looks like all put together. Oh, wow. So. Okay. Let's see how this goes. Well, I think I got the basic pieces put together the way they should be. Now I gotta get all the little bits and bobs and see what holds together what. That's basically how it goes together. And getting these little nut things screwed on. You just seem to go on pretty easy there. Yeah. 
It was easier to tip it over on its side to get all these on. And like I said, make sure they're all nice and tight. Get this one on. And there's one more that goes in the center here. Let me get this one nice and tight. All right, I gotta get this thing tipped back over. Maybe. Oh, I might need two hands to do this. Get this thing moved back over. Uh, two hands and a foot. Or get just a foot. And here we go. There we go. I got my hammock frame sitting here. Oh. Maybe about to move it around under the tree a bit here. And now let's see what how you're supposed to do these hooks. I got the hooks here and trying to make the hooks go in a downward position. Looks like they both go downward. All right. I'll see if I can get that done. Okay. Well, I think I got it on the way it's supposed to go. Downward position on both sides. That's the way it looks. And, uh, okay. And then you put the hammock through there, and I guess you hook the end on the hooks. And you have all these holes, so you can adjust it and have it higher or lower. I probably, having it on the top hole there, that's probably the lowest setting, and I may need, want to put it up a little higher. But we'll see if we can figure out how to string the hammock, and... And, uh... Let's see how it looks. Well, I'm not sure if I got this right, but this seems to be the way it's supposed to go. I guess awful high. I thought it would sit a bit lower. Huh. Anyways, I don't know. This seems awful high, but we'll see if it actually holds me. Let's see. Whoa. Well, so far, I I'm, I'm, haven't tipped out yet onto the ground. Um, yeah, haven't tipped out yet. It kind of feels like it's closing in on me, though. Let's see if we can turn this. Oh, no, it won't turn the picture around. So we'll just do this. And yep, woo! <laughs> oh, well, interesting. I'll have to see how this goes. It's a little, not quite what I expected, but uh, I thought I thought there'd be a little more uh, give. But yeah, uh, this thing can curl right up around me. I guess it's made for two people. If they want to so so we'll see yeah there's there's my feet okay yeah I'm not sure how they get the photographs I've seen photographs and they then the, it seems to be all out but maybe I need to get these 
cords here a little more strung out. I don't know. Maybe they, they could be a little twisted and that may be why it's kind of hangs like this. It's because these are a little twisted. I may need to do some untwisting. So, anyways. We'll see how that goes. I guess this bag here is for storing the storing everything in and during the uh, winter when you're not using it you can take it all apart and put it in bag it up and store it okay well I tried to straighten the ropes out a little bit I think I got them as straight as I can get them I'll just have to come out here with a pillow or something so that this thing doesn't collapse inside on top of me. But it might be kind of fun to relax on. Apparently it will hold my weight. I kind of wonder about things, you know. Especially when you don't know where they've been made. <sighs> I can actually rock in this. It'll make a great rocking chair. Too. Yep. Rocking away. I hope I don't make anybody seasick. <laughs> yep. Now I gotta clean up all my mess. I got boxes and stuff all over the my lawn. Yep. I need to clean up. Well, everyone, uh, anybody like and if you like the video, please like, subscribe, hit the little bell notification, and uh, I'll see y'all on my next video.